forgot to start recording. Okay, welcome to the stream. Then we're going to be doing the good old Eve remake. It's about time this thing happened. Of course, even then I'm still late to the party, but... You know, it's... Hey. It's pretty good. Now, to be honest, I think the last time I've ever had anything to do with Eve was way back in middle school, just years ago. That's the last time I seen a playthrough. I mean, so I have seen this game before, of course. And, uh... But I don't remember all of it. It's not... It's not like Witch's House to me, the way like I memorized Witch's House like the back of my hand. That was my number one favorite RPG horror. If you ask me to like put down every item placement and write down every map, I could do it for you. Mark every single death, everything. This game is I'm probably the least familiar with, and you know, for a reason. Cause you know, I never really did find this game all too scary. It wasn't all that captivating to me. But, you know, it's still a good game in and of itself, you know. So that's what we're going to be doing today. Let me just... Uh... Oh, by the way, before we start, I guess we can share another dream. Get another dream shared. So, okay, it's... I did have a video recording, but I lost it on my old phone. So I just have to re uh, retell it. Right here, right now, without any script to go off of. <clears throat> so I might miss a few details, but basically, I was going... It was in high school when I... In real life, I was taking a, a AP Biology class. I hated that class. It was really hard for me. <clears throat> I finished with, like, a C. So, in the dream I had is we were camping with the family. You know, got our camper out, set up, and I had biology homework to do in my dream. So I get it out and there are these problems. I cannot solve them. I look at them. And it's just, none of this makes sense. What am I supposed to do? I go and I say, guys, this makes sense to you. I can't understand it. I give it to my mom. My mom looks at it and she says, oh yeah, I think I do. She gives it back and she says, yeah, it's easy. Just read the text. I read it and it turns out it's just a sheet printed full of memes and our homework assignment was to review them. <laughs> like, we just had to look at the memes and write down what we thought for the assignment. And the next page was actual biology homework, but... Yeah. So I get that done, and then the game grumps come over. <laughs> Aaron and Dan, they, they show up, and they're like, Hey, man, you want to play a game? Like, oh, man, the game grumps, of course, I'd love to. This is great. This is crazy. So they get a deck of cards, and they say, all right, so do you know how to play? Well, before before that, I remember they showed me the cards, and for some reason, Jesus was on the king card in their deck. Like, instead of that suicide king or whatever, it's just the king card. Or the Jesus is on the king card. And they, they asked me, okay, so you know how to play? And I said, no, you guys are going to have to teach me. And they say, all right, that's fine. So uh, you go first. And without telling me how to play at all, I'm, I'm sitting there like, dude, what the heck? I, I, I don't know how to play. And upon hearing this for the second time, they get mad and leave. And they just, yeah. <laughs> so we go to sleep. We wake up the next day. And uh, what? Yeah, we go fishing. So what we did is we got like these uh, gummy worms, pretty much. Except they weren't actually gummy worms. They were just like normal night crawlers, except they were like just really, they're dyed really loud colors, you know? Like just lime green and just a deep dark blue. Not dark, it's just a deep, just a deep, deep blue. And I put it on my rod, I throw it in, I catch a really small fish, and then I catch another one that is not a real fish, from what I remember. It's just a non-existent fish. And I keep fishing, you know, bobber, bobber fishing. It was my favorite back then. And my dad comes up, and he's like, all right, guys, let's see. All right, we got two fish. You know what that means, fellas? I'm very disappointed in you people, he says. And then he throws both the fish back in the water and walks away. I'm thinking, okay, this is not working. we got to get some bigger fish. 
So what I do is I think I use up my last worm and I'm sitting there like, well, I guess that's it. There's nothing left I can do. And then I hear a conversation between a mother and her child. She says, don't you know the old saying? In order to catch something, you got to use what it was. I, I Forgive me. It's really blurry. She said something along the lines of uh, you catch what you use or something like that. And I'm sitting there and just like an epiphany, epiphany hits me like a truck. I'm like, oh, my God, that's it. So what I do is I take my bobber and my hook without anything on it. I throw it in the water. And I reel in my line, and I catch another, a same bobber and hook on my bobber and hook. And I'm like, great, now we got more stuff. And it doesn't solve the bait problem. I'm not sure why it progressed the dream. So I do that. I get on a jet ski. I start driving around. I'm crashing into islands, just ping-ponging around the lake. And then I don't remember what happens next. I come back. I think I climb a tree, and I fall down. Maybe I didn't. I don't remember. I, all, I, all I remember is I did climb a tree and something happened. I came back down. Uh, then I try... We were staying at a resort, pretty much. It was revealed at that point in the dream that we were staying at a, res or a resort. And I needed to buy more bait. So what I do is I reach in my pockets. I pull out like five pennies. And I go up to the the manager of the place and I believe I tried to sell him his own merchandise. <laughs> and the thing is, he sold, like, computer parts and, like, pieces of, of computer mice, you know? He sold those. I took them from the shelves, and I tried to sell it to him. And he's like, dude, we can't do any of that. Sorry, just go home. So I leave. I climb up the tree again, and there's my uncle up there. And he goes, all right, Chance, you got to really watch out. You don't want to fall like last time, do you? And I say, no, I don't. So I start crawling through the treetops. And all of a sudden, this giant freaking grizzly bear jumps out of the leaves and tackles me. And we both go flying to the ground. And my uncle's laughing at me the entire way as I fall, pointing and laughing like a child. So what happens is I land in a thorny bush. And it's a soft landing for me for some reason. While the bear lands in a river and nearly dies. <laughs> kind of got it mixed up. So then it turned into a... The whole dream after that turned into a movie trailer. Where my entire family and me were in the river swimming away from this grizzly bear. And it's just this entire trailer. Like a movie trailer. Just going on about what will happen with the bear. Will they catch him? What's going to happen? You know? And then I think for some reason Crank Gameplays, Ethan, he was there. And he starts going on, is like, you know, this 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 trailer is getting kind of goofy, right? It's becoming more and more self-aware as time goes on. And in the middle of that sentence, the bear comes up and dunks his head underwater, and he's struggling, nearly drowning, screaming underwater. And finally, he breaks free, comes to the surface, and he says, well, I mean, the dessert was kind of all right. I mean, it was a little delectable, but nothing much more than that. Just like nothing happened. I don't know why he said that, but he did. And then the, the river just... we we The river stopped. It's just the end of the world. There's just a brick wall. Goes on forever. And the river runs right into it. And that's that. It's just... That was it. The end of the world right there. And I woke up. That's what happened. It's... I don't get it. Why this stuff... I don't... Why I have these dreams, I will never know, but by God, I do love them. I would, there's nothing, you know, it's just, I wouldn't trade them for anything else in the world. But yeah, I've been babbling on for long enough, so uh, I suppose let's get on with the game, huh? If it would, uh... Here we are. Alright, Eeb, here we are. The actual attraction, 16 minutes in. So, yeah, well, here we go. Water sounds, huh? And 
the early afternoon, under a grey sky, Abe and her parents were on their way to an art gallery. Did you remember everything, Abe? Oh, do you have your handkerchief? You know, the one you got for your birthday? Keep it safe in your pocket, okay? Don't lose it. Oh man, back to it, huh? Yo, look at this, man! This is... Oh, man! All right, we're here. It's your first time in the art gallery, isn't it, Abe? We're here today to see an ex exhibition. I think that's the word. Of works by an artist named Gortina. Besides just paintings, there are also sculptures and all kinds of other creations. I don't doubt that even you'll be able to enjoy it, Abe. Should we check in at the front desk? Ah, yes. Let's get some pamphlets as well. The dad looks really different, doesn't he? Almost a downgrade. Hmm? You want to start looking around? Really now, Eve. <sighs> oh, all right. Just make sure you're quiet in the gallery, okay? Don't make a ruckus. I don't suppose I'll have to worry about that when it comes to you, though. Don't cause the other visitors any nuisance now. See? We can zoom, huh? X. Lace handkerchief. A treasured white handkerchief from mother. How do I... Okay, okay, X to go back. No sprint in this one, eh? Maybe I should go have a smoke. Yep. Dad is talking with the receptionist. And the save points. Man, this is all slowly... Okay, her head looks weird. This is all slowly coming back to me, man. Don't go on... Don't get in the man's way, Abe. What's this... Welcome to the world of Guertena. We truly thank you for unknown today. We're currently showcasing a on the works of a great artist, Wace Guertena. We hope you deeply enjoy the art of the late Guertena, whose creations carry such mystery and beauty both. You don't know some of these words. It's a lot of emphasis on that. It's cloudy outside. On table. Da da. Hang on. Da 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 da. Hmm. Lady taking the newspaper. In my opinion, what Gratana is saying here is that the individual lies in one expression. Which is why these statues don't have heads, see? Um... Hmm, as I thought. Someone your age wouldn't understand, would you? Sorry. At any rate, these statues have great proportions. What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? Death of the individual. What a strange sofa. But I like that. I like that about it. I'd love to sit on it, but I suppose I shouldn't. Reserved a seat. Bitter fruit. Diamond. The third floor serves as a rest area. I don't, there never was a third floor, was there? At least I don't remember. I apologize if my daughter is bothering you. Wait, why am I? Am I supposed to be this? T have I? I feel like I shouldn't be this tall. Unless I don't know. Worry. Towers. <laughs> Tilted towers! <laughs> what a beautiful woman. But I wonder if she was someone real. The St. Gortana hardly ever depicted people who actually existed. But some sure do seem like real people, don't they? Like this woman here. It's amazing. The lady in red. Glass of blank. Hey, it's cotton care. It's cotton, cotton candy hair, babe. People. My, simply incredible. This painting would look perfect hanging in our living room. Hmm, superb. I'm truly jealous of Master Gortana's genius. <laughs> oh, you really? What happens if I... The old man lay, old lady is studying it intently. That rainbow stuff looks kind of tasty. I mean, if it's taste cleansing, then maybe it's candy. <laughs> taste cleansing tree. I want to take that rainbowy stuff. Oh man, there's no yes option. Uh, they'll get mad. You're boring. I want to take that rainbow. Oh, it's a bad idea. Whoa, why is that? There's tons just hanging there. Lame. Oh no. Looks like James's giant peach finally got its fix uppins. Doesn't this ex exhibition seem kind of small? Shouldn't there be more pieces than this? From what I hear, they didn't have the space or budget to even remotely show everything. Huh. It's a shame Gortana's kind of an obscure artist. She only gets exhibits at tiny galleries like this. It'd be nice if more people knew about him, really. It's a kitty! Mommy, there's a kitty picture! Yes, yes, I get it. Be quiet. I told you not to shout. 
Let's see if there's any... No, she's not. I read these, right? I'm pretty sure there's an achievement. There's one achievement in this game, and I'm I'm going to try my best to get it. Uh, it's just I think you need to examine everything. Is he part of the next battle pass? Says chat. I mean, oh god, what? Oh, this is where. Okay, so it's different. I I don't want to come up here yet. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised at this rate. Fortnite's taken everything, man. Yeah, I read this already. Say, do you ever find yourself thinking you want to get a closer look at art? Personally, I don't hesitate to get my face up in there if I'm so inclined. I recommend it to get a better look at what's in the paintings. Oh, shoot. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so that's what that feature is. Oh, it's Mom. Gautain isn't the most famous artist, but I've, I've been eagerly anticipating this ex ex exhibition. I hope you come to appreciate his art too, Eve. Yeah, Abe, take a look at this painting. Amazing, isn't it? I bet this is your first time seeing such a huge painting. A well-meaning hell! This one big old display. Almost feels like that fish really is swimming down there. But if it actually was, I'd probably wet myself, not gonna lie. Hmm, it's like looking deep down into the sea from the surface. I want so badly to see this place with my own eyes. It's completely different from seeing it in a book. The mood is just so... you know? Ooh, so this is the one they put in all the magazine ads. Maybe I should, uh... <clears throat> yeah, maybe I'll, um... Well, I want to see what these people say. Oh, I didn't read the... Of the Deep. A world where man can never stand. To explore that world, I decided to paint it within the canvas. I'm just guessing here. Unknown Sloppy McGloppy. Sir Gortana was indeed astounding. I cannot hold him in high enough regard. Alas, if only you were still alive, I would have gladly been your apprentice. Look at this boy. The Coughing Man. Do not to be confused with the Crooked Man. A truly marvelous painting. How does one even paint something like this? Selfless Guard. I feel like the slightest jolt could make that stock snap into a million pieces. I wonder how much they'd make me pay for it. <laughs> that's a scary thought. Of spirit. Beautiful little glance, but should you get too close, it brings pain. It looms only in unknown bodies. This piece is pretty incredible, but I wish I could see it from higher up. <laughs> I can. Please refrain from touching the displays. Eternal sleep. Spirit. Team spirit? Smells like it, perhaps? At water's edge. Well. <clears throat> ah, certainly different. Can I leave? Hey, let's see what happens if I try. You can't leave by yourself. I'm gonna make a save here. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. It keeps a tally? Aw, oh, sweet. Okay. That's a lot of artwork. Well, uh, okay, I think... Okay, so that one... Lady in red. The cat. Alright, so there's some I need to check again. World. Oh no, the lights! What? Da 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 Question mark? World. Okay, cat. Your dark figure. The apple fall out of the painting still? Oh. No. The hanged man? The hanged man. Not to be confused with the hanged man. The lady in red. Scary? It's cloudy outside. Do... Oh, yeah, yeah. Do I need to... Yeah. There we go. Now it's getting spooky. Oh, there's noise. There's foot... Footprints. Scary? Pick black outside. Doesn't look like it to me. What? The moon open. Did I already try to leave? I can't remember what happened. I got a terrible memory. Scary? Scary? Yeah, there it is. I remember. Um, then this apple falls. Yep, and then the cat meows. Yeah, <laughs> just like I kind of remember it. And the the stat that painting. One of them. Maybe I'm getting confused with the coughing, man. I thought it would look... Uh... 
Ooh, no one's around. A well-meaning, a well-meaning penis. That wasn't even funny. I'm sorry for doing that. What is this? I didn't see that. Horizon view. I mean, I never did like that school, but you know, all about perspective, I suppose. The sky seen from a hill. And then Mrs. Manny goes, "Whoa!" Does he not? <coughs> there he goes. Okay, so I did get everything right. I'm gonna be very upset if I didn't. Um, I think that's it. I'll just make a save here in case. Sorry. Oh, I I peed myself. What do you have to say for yourself? This game too scary, says chat member. One, two, three, four, five, six. 79, 10, 11. What have I... I feel like I missed a lot. I only have 14. Yeah, this I missed a whole bunch, right? What happened, man? There should be more than 14, right? Unless the sculptures don't matter? Of a century's end, that doesn't seem familiar. Can I, is there a way to, um, no. Dark figure, diamond, a fallen fruit, tis the way of life, when life gives you lemons, I don't know, eat them, and regret everything. Well, I guess that, yeah, okay, that must be it. Who's walking still? Okay, what do I do next? I think... Wasn't there... Do I need to go... Oh, I bet you... Okay, I gotta go back to the main painting, yes. Up we go. Oh, there's a handprint now? There's a mark from someone banging on it, dot dot dot. Oh, that's the other thing I forgot about this game, is it uses way too many ellipses. It's just like... God dang it, dude. There's a blue liquid leaking from behind the frame. Come, Eve! I'll show you a secret spot. I don't like your tone, sir. Right here. Oh man, there's an actual animation of it this time. So immersive. Hi. You don't really understand this painting. I can really understand this painting. Or as Marker Warfire would say, Oh boy, where do I go? The red pits of hell or the blue pits of hell? I'll go the red pits of hell. Come, come, everybody, just come. When the rose wilts, so too will you, etc. Take the rose. Oh man, that's. Didn't I used to. Yeah, okay, I think it always was five. The hair is drooping out of the frame. Something on the ground. Oh, it's her expression. This is a bit different. Thief. I, I almost didn't notice the text on the wall. Thief. The question mark fish. The poo poo pee pee man. Wait, 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 what, what? Hey, hey. Why is there no new artwork here, huh? Okay. Oh, you just put it in the frame, huh? Painting of a ladybug. Painting of a bee. Painting of a butterfly. Painting of a spider. Hello, mister. I'm an ant. I love paintings. I want to see my painting, but it's kind of far away. Beware of the edges. Yes, I remember this part. Prologue. Chapter 1, Chapter 2, Last Chapter. Can't cross this hole in the floor. Yes, so we need that painting. I remember this part. Oh. What happened, man? 
painting of an ant. Actually, it looks like this painting can be taken off the wall. Sure. I got the ant painting. Ow, no! Okay, that one got me. I guess I gotta say the this the uh oh it's my painting. It's just as cool as I remember it. Stares lovingly. Oh man. I remember when it was just stare. A pretty red rose, almost too beautiful to be real. Ant painting, a large depiction of an ant contained in a sturdy frame. Hey, got my rose in hand. Alright. Off we go. You can't cross this hole in the floor. You lay down the ant painting? Yes. The ant painting got- Oh, that's what was supposed to happen. I thought the painting uh, cracked before. Epilogue. A headless statue. Something on the ground, but got the green key. Oh no. Dude, what happened to all the sound effects, huh? What you gonna do, huh? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you, what you, okay. There he goes. What happened to my painting? I ate it to gain its power. Alright, 19 out of 50, 150, not just 50. Oh, I never examined the key. Ah, the cat. Okay, good thing there's another save point. Fish shaped hole in the wall. Can't look at much. There are lots of dirty palettes and brushes inside. Yeah, baby. Good old, good old, huh? So, what's this? Oh, can't examine that. What's here? Next, it attacks and to animals. Why? The box is empty. The shelf is not empty. Quite the opposite, in fact. Some strange ornaments inside. Dirty shoes and gloves. What could this be? Looks like you could push it. Oh, yeah, there's a... Oh, oh I think I... No, I, I'm all good. What is... What? This is new. Hello? Stool, the stool grew four legs. <laughs> Look at feet. There's a high-heeled shoe on each foot. <laughs> One of the legs is missing a shoe. Okay. Listen... From under the skirt like cloth, you can hear a faint moaning sound. What the heck? Observe. This. Okay. Yes, it's a stool. I guess I gotta. Oh, this dude. Hey, he's actually animated this time. He's doing stretches. Play hide and seek? Okay. Hang on. Alright. Uh. I remember, this is actually the only part that scared me throughout the entire playthrough, way back in middle school, in the original version. Well, obviously, because this is... It's been years since this... before. Whatever. Is the red hand. Let's see. There's a button behind the curtain. Cush it! Oh no, it's scary! <laughs> button behind the curtain. Cush it! Oh, it's me. A painting of you collapsed for some reason. Can I die again? You don't want to get near this painting. Does it still say hide and seek, I wonder? Yep. Push it. Ew! It's dark. Yeah, that was the only part that scared me in the original version. It was just a jump scare. Dude, they really dumbed it down. This is like the diet version of the original, man. Oh no. I don't want to get banned on Twitch. Push it. There he is! What's this button? No, the music! Ah! How can you... How can you... How? Uh, hang on, I gotta think of the joke. How can you free my soul without the rock and roll, man? Found me, you get prize. Ooh. Oh yeah, I didn't look at this painting, did I? A chef's talent. There's something on the ground. I've seen the wooden fish head. Alright, so that's part one. Uh, let's see, what's it say? Wooden fish head. A wooden fish head, but where's the tail? 
Let's save. 27 out of etc. I'm not... Oh, yeah. So I'm missing a... Oh, hey, hey, hey. Um, right there, right there, right there. Shoes. You see a small blue high heel at the bottom. Got a glass heel. A very small high heeled shoe. Probably not for humans. Uh... Give high heel. Put down the glass heel. Oh, look good on me. Did it. It. Look at it. Seems to be following you. Okay. Wait, don't stop there. Move! Come here. And stop there. What? There's something here. Got the wooden fish tail. Man, why'd they change this? You combine a wooden fish head with the wooden fish tail. Got the fish sculpture. I mean, I guess it's more fun. Yeah, it's a lot more fun than the original, I suppose. He's just wandering around. She's smucking off. Fish sculpture. Head and tail together to make a complete fish. Are you guys ready for the cat rave party? Insert. <coughs> Whoops, I didn't know me to go that far. Yeah, epic. Room of big eyes. Oh, I was wondering where the music went for a second. Oh, this dude, he spits. Yep, and then the spit eats you. His tongue keeps wiggling. Mm, I can take a couple more hits before I die. Unbalanced box. It's this clockwork plant. A flower pot with a small sprout inside. I didn't... Am I, I already forgot what that said. Okay, so it's nothing to do with clockwork. At least so it seems. Is this a newspaper? Just when you've forgotten. Ah, oh, yes, the hands. Beware of... What? Raging lips? He bites me. I want to see. Hungry, give food. Ah! Raging lips. Why? Oh. oh. I wasn't thinking. I wasn't... I won't give up. A real ninja never gives up! I don't need him to bite me again. Oh, man. Call me Jake Paul because I'm not making that joke. Who's this dude? A doll is dangling from the ceiling. Oh, no, there he goes. There's a doll on the ground. Oh, wait, what's this? There's a rock shaped wind up key on the floor. Turn it. Uh. Oh, so it got bigger. Clockwork plant, I've with a small tree inside. Why do I need the tree? I'm not sure. What's this door say? The liar's room. Alright, I kinda remember this. Um, I'm not gonna try and think about what- Try. I'm not gonna try and remember what the solution was. I'll try and figure out again. It won't turn any further. Okay, so I gotta find more, it seems. Huh? Why? I am uncertain, but... What was this again? Oh yeah, paper. Yeah, just when you've forgotten. It's talking about the, uh... God, the spit is so small, man. Well. I think it was yellow, but, uh... The correct tile is F6. The correct tile is B2. The one in white speaks the truth. Then you have to be lying. That's the correct tile. The only truthful... Okay, so it wasn't yellow. The only truthful one is the one in green. I agree with the one in yellow. Which means you don't. There's an odd one out. Tile. The only truthful one is... So green cannot be it. Um, green... The one white speaks the truth. So it's not white. It can't be blue, red, or yellow. So I guess, uh, B2? Because, I mean, they didn't refer to... Well, unless I'm missing something. I feel stupid already. You don't agree with the one in yellow. And you want me to be wrong. So I'm guessing... I'm just gonna go with brown. Cause I mean, I... Ah, dude, I don't know. I already forgot. B2? 
You guys ready to see me eat shush and die? Pizza. Ah, so that's it. I heard, I thought the uh, old puzzle was a lot more. Oh no, Half Life crowbar sound effect. I thought the uh, old puzzle was a lot more interesting. Liar, Shears. Liar, 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 liar. The painting. Well, joke's on you guys. This is a liar's room, which means you are lying. Therefore, you're saying he's telling the truth. It checks out. Oh, shoot, there's something growing on the tree now. Clockwork plant. There's more blood growing on the branch. So I need to find another? Oh, yes, I need to get the wooden apple. That's it. But where do I find another? Hmm. Oh, it's over here. Turn it. All right, that's uh, blue fruit. Take it. Blue fruit. What's this? A fruit with a strange aroma and an otherworldly color. Hmm. Well, I know what I must do. Ow! Oh, are you serious? I meant to save. I'm trying to save. Trust me. Trust me. Only 29 out of 150, huh? The food. The food. Give to me. Give the blue fruit. He's gonna bite me. Ouch. Yeah, you know. Man, I like the old sound effect with the, the uh, apples, because I'd always be like, oh man, wooden apple. It sounds like he's eating a bunch of Pez, and then I'd go and get Pez, and I'd eat it while the, <laughs> while the video played. <laughs> I'd be like, yeah, look at me. I'm like the lips. I, 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 I got lips. Look at me, guys. I'm in the game. This tasty. You good. Let you pass. Go through my mouth. Sweet. I can't zoom out. Do it again, no balls. Do it again. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Hey, I'm waiting. Do it. Do it. Freaking suck. No balls. More like blue balls. Jeez. I think there's a secret path here, right? Okay, this music is a little more eerie than I remember. Is there not a secret path? Hey, the breath of life or something? Breath. Oh yes, there's no shadow here. Clever. Soul... Something. How clever. Alright, and why is there only one other... Why? I don't get it. Is it not tracking correctly? I'm really sad if I have to play this again. Alright. Uh-uh. Pattern. Shut. Open. Now look at this dude. He's got a butt coming out of the smoke. Smoking. Heartbeat. Beep. Beep. What's this? Heart wounds. And this crazy bee is gonna come alive and try to eat my face. <laughs> hmm. Oh, it's getting kind of fast. Okay, 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 okay. I really gotta go. I really gotta go, huh? I gotta go! Oh, I didn't get time to look at the key. Um. Can I go out? <laughs> oh, okay. Bookmark with writing on it, stuck between two books. Having fun? I guess. There's no keyhole. The door must open some other way. There's an eyeball on it. Art galleries of the world. It's filled with pictures of different galleries. Moving storybook. Written, drawn by, uh... A lot of tens. Carrie Careless and the Gallet de Roy Salomon. In the Gallet de Roy! I'm not the spy. Never mind. What's this? The woman in canvas. The one here quickly grow fond of humans. Once their sights are set, they become quite something. They'll continue to freaking chase you until they're satisfied, it seems. 
anywhere, everywhere to the ends of the earth. But if they have one weak, but if they have one weakness, it's that they can't open doors on their own. Oh, it's the ladies in, the ladies in red. All right, story time. Monokuma Theater. Happy birthday! Hey, this is Witch's House stuff. Thanks, guys, for your special day. We made a gallant dish rice. I don't know. What's that? There's a coin in this pie, and if you find the slice with the coin in it, then you'll have good luck. That sounds like fun, <laughs> doesn't it? Okay, let's divide it up. Now pick the slice you want. Xbox! Let's eat. Nom, munch. Ah! What is it? I think I just swallowed something hard. <laughs> Clumsy carry. That must have been the coin. What do I do? It's fine. It's just a little coin. Well, I'll clean up now. What's wrong, Mom? Have you seen the key to the study? To the study? It's always right here on this table. Huh? It's the coin. The coin that should have gone in the pie. I wonder if... What could it have gone? Oh, your father will be so upset. What do I do? No, don't do it. Guess I was just as careless as Carrie. Oh no! <laughs> Found the key! I'll open the door now. That storybook is nowhere to be found. Okay, that's interesting. Except it's right there, which kind of sucks. That, that kind of ruins it. But, hey, not, not bad. Okay, 34. Eternal Blessing. Do nothing. What's this? Undercloth. Rat? Rats. Rats. When the rose wilts, so too will you die. I don't know. You and the rose are inseparable. You must learn the weight of life. I'm just guessing again. The window is foggy. She can't see inside. There's spots that look like blood on the floor. There are blue petals on the ground. The lady in blue. Oh no! It's her second form. It's locked. There's a tiny key, it seems. Oh no. Living Mountain. A Klaus person. Say something. Uh, it hurts. He's in pain. Wasn't, uh, wasn't the original option to massage his shoulders for some reason? Uh, that's... Come on, guys. You took away the best parts of this. I mean, it's... You get... Yeah, it's nicer puzzles. Funner, more fun puzzles, but... Stop. <coughs> He's in a lot of pain. What if I do it again? <laughs> Did you guys know I don't really like this guy? Actually, it's fine. I kind of do, but it's more of an inside joke between my friends. Observe. Hmm? Oops. Uh, I didn't read that. Uh, saw a key. Small key, taken from a man's hand. Where can it be used? Up my butt. <laughs> Art. Headless statue. Just tongue just keeps wiggling. Wasn't it wagging in the first one? Man, I remember a lot more than I th thought I would have. Uh, okay. Here's a small key. Oh no, he's, she's draining his life force. Hey there. <laughs> Got the blue rose. E a rose with barely any petals, it said. Yeah, baby, that scare. That was a good one. Not really, but I just, it's a nice detail. Alright, saving, saving time. What? Okay, now it's, okay. I was wondering why uh, it had 37 in the auto save, but 34 in the normal save. Oh, yeah, I gotta uh, get this drenched in uh, Heman. This blue rose. Blue is turned to health. Red Rose, return to health. Alright, and give this ding old thing to the man. Mm -hmm. uh, what's this? The paint's faded. Hmm? 
Eek! What is it this time? I've nothing left for you to take. Wait, dear me, could you be a person from the gallery? You are, aren't you? Oh, <laughs> thank heavens. There's someone here besides me. I see. And then you wouldn't know a thing about the how or why of all this either, huh? Well, it was pretty much the same as what you described, too. All right, down to these roses. Pain runs through me if the petals are plucked. I thought I was a goner there. Thank you for getting it back. Now, first things first. Shall we look for a way out? I think I'll go mad if I stay in this dreadful place for too long. Uh, I still haven't asked you your name. <laughs> my, that was rude of me. Well, my name's Gary. And you are? I'm not telling you. Eve. Eve, you say. It's dangerous for a child to wander here alone, so I'll accompany you, okay? Now let's go, Eve. <laughs> there he goes, he's dead. Da 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 da. I, I was just a little startled, really, nothing more than that. Anyway, we had to keep an eye open for bizarre things like that. I'm gonna talk. E. At any rate, I'll be happy to stick with you until we find an exit. Oh, it's not randomly generated. Hey, there's Gary Head. Yeah, Gary. Headless statue. Gary. Sing sure he's in a lousy place. Step back a bit, would you, Eve? And heave! Ta-da! Now we can proceed. Alright, off we go. Yes. Oh, man. Grieving groom and grieving bride. Bride's left hand. Bride's right hand. What is this thing? Oh, look at this! Some strange blocking the door. Touch him. Oh, it's a cat. Ouch! Hey, Ack, are you all right? I think we ought to stay away. No. Observe. Its back is slowly going up and down. Doesn't appear to be a stuffed animal. Have Gary move it. I don't want to get pricked. Can we leave this for later? Get pricked. You wouldn't it be more bitten. Oh, maybe it was the fur that got crazy. It's Gary. He's got too many R's in his name. Listen to the teapot's demands. What the heck? Yeah, what is that? It's gross. Why are there eyes on the floor? Hello. D doesn't this one eye seem a bit bloodshot? I wonder if there's anything. Oh man. A painting of what looks like icebergs. A painting of a white snake. Looking closer, the eye part is sunken in. A painting of a coffee cup and cake. And a painting of an upside down woman. Hello. <laughs> Flowers. Flowers are nice. Give me that there flower and I'll let you go through. <laughs> you flower, pretty please. No. Wait, I almost gave it. I just want it for a little bit. <laughs> oh no, he's crazy. I'm not going to do that much laughing. Um, got the cat, got the door I never tried. Oh boy. Oh, this is the teapot's demands. Um, so... Let's see, so, um... The scent sensitive porky pus. What the heck? Scent sensitive porky pus. Oh, that's an odd one. Why not porcupine? Porcupus. <laughs> I like porcupine, uh... Yes, I suppose we ought to respect the artist's intentions for what it's worth. Gortana certainly uses some odd words, though. Little wonder you need help understanding them. How do you know? There's text engraved in a large teapot. Tea cups are not permitted to be picked up. Common sense di dictates that teacups move in straight lines. We pour tea only into cups of the same color. Indeed, it does seem there are four teapots and four cups, one in each four colors. You guys won't stop until they bump into something. Okay, so let's think. We got the blue, we got the blue, the blue, the blue, the blue, the blue. So we can move this here. Do one of these. One of that. Oh, jeez. Um, that there. Uh-huh. Do this. Okay, 
what if I, yeah, okay, I can do this, do that, uh, this, this, and, uh, that, okay, that's two, hmm, Ah, jeez, I'm stuck now. I need one right here. So, um... If I... Well... Hang on a second. So green was the problem. We can just straight away do this and this. Then we can get... Uh... That. Yes, yes, yes. And, uh... Yeah, okay, that was a lot simpler than it needed to do. Uh, than, I, than I made it out to be. Dingle boing bing. Oh boy, my favorite freaking yellow tea. More like yellow pee, huh? The smell of tea began to walk through the room. Strong smelling tea, a strong smelling tea, a strong smelling tea, a strong smelling tea. Why did I- Oh yes, he's back here. The sense of the porcupus. Now, where have I seen this face before? Listen to the teapot's demands. That better be a tail. Something's just sticking out of the frame. Looks like a tail. But wait, never mind that. The strange thing in front of the door is gone. Now we can go inside. But what if I don't want to? Ah, uh, this, uh... Oh yes, the eye drops. Yep, okay. Set myself up for that one. Um, I can, whoops, I can go this way, I can, I can, I can. Hmm. There we go. Something on the stool, got the eye drops. I can't look at the painting. It makes me sad. Man. Uh, what's the eye drops? Kept in a little bottle. Use the soothe hurting eyes. No clicking noise. Bloodshot eyes looking your way. No, it's not. Stare back. Um, Eve, what are you doing? Apply the eye drops to the eye, and then he goes cute mode, yeah? Look at him, the eye's cured. And then he goes slipping by, and he's looking at the wall. I gave you, I gave the eye drops a staring toward the wall. Don't you mean a door? Wait, the wall here looks unusual. Found a secret passage. Something at your feet, obtained a red glass ball. Okay, and this goes in the snake picture, right? Is it, oh wait, no, I want to look at it. I love the little red ball, it shines like a gem. Hmm? There's writing on the back of the frame, in the skull's left hand. Uh, did I miss something? Oh, yes, he was... okay. Wine sofa. A giant wine glass cut diagonally with a red cushion inside. Doesn't look very comfortable to sit on. Depends on what you're into, I guess. Melancholy. You're not sure how to say this word. Melancholy, huh? Well, really, why? who wouldn't be in this place? Look at this dude. Puzzle. A colorful skeleton. He's got real bones, surely. Feeling. A tree sculpture that vaguely resembles a person. It takes a clever mind to come up with this stuff. Does it really? Something gleams on the skeleton's finger. A ring? Ah, it seems it comes off. Got the silver ring. So, so much large, pretty ring with an intricate design. Oh, we can save. It's been a while, huh? 46, why? Okay. The autosave again. So, left hand. Yeah, put on a, the fourth finger. Hooray! I wonder, actually, what happens if I get it wrong? Hang on a second, let's, let's actually see. Let's just throw it on the right hand, on the thumb. 
Where it belongs. The ring flew back off. Okay. <laughs> I just... What if... <laughs> what a shoot about is, like, the hand just stops, just, like, wiggles the, the, the ring off and just punches you right in the frickin' gob, dude. That would have been awesome. Full finger. Alright. Happy time. Oh man, the bouquet, I got it. You know what that means, I, I got flowers now, and nothing else. Blessed groom, blessed bride. Blessed bride, bless, blessed bride, blessed bride, blessed bride, blessed bride. That's kinda tricky. Oh no, my battery's running low! Whoa, jeez! Uh, okay, I got it, I got it. Give me that there flower, and I'll let you through. <laughs> Your flower, pretty please. No. God, that voice hurts. Hang on, I want to see it. A very beautiful bouquet with various flowers on it. Give the bouquet. Hand it over the bouquet. <laughs> Thanks. Smells nice. <laughs> well, chow time. Ah, that was good. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks so much. As promised, you can take this door. <laughs> Be seeing ya. <laughs> oh no, it's crazy boy! This thing, the mannequin has looked a lot creepier, I suppose. I really don't like that. Mm. Always looking at me? At least he's trying. No eyes! <laughs> no eyes, McGee! Ah, I thought I was supposed to pass out this time around. A painting of a woman! Be careful, I was attacked by a painting just like this. You knew that? Ah, right, of course. You got my rose back from it. I'm impressed, I'm impressed you were able to get away. This is different. Oh, who's this? The lady gazing at emptiness. My, this painting has a different feel from the other painted ladies. Those creepy pitch black eyes. I, I prefer to keep my distance. Hmm, interesting. Input the four numbers hidden in the painting, then knock. <laughs> Knock upon the door, excuse me. Four numbers, huh? I take it hidden in the painting means there's a hint in some painting. Yes, because we are in a horror game. As you would, as you know. Look at this dude, a golden elephant with a lamp hanging from it. I thought it said lump. What's he doing, huh? A newspaper spread out here on the floor. Lady reading the newspaper. It's dark here, so it's hard to read the news. Well, there's, there's... you got a lamp. Hey. Move aside, I can't read my paper. What if I don't? Hey. What if I don't? What if I don't? <laughs> yeah. Oh. I guess the lamp... Now the lamp's on. Have the statue, have the statue. Yo, that one's got... No, they all got those things in the shoulders, huh? A hanging white cage. Mm, let's see, if we pull down this cage... The great hero will raise up, yes? Simple enough. <laughs> oh man, look at that portrait. <laughs> Gah. Sorry, as I feared, brute force won't work here. What, are we gonna have to like put a bird inside or something? That'll do it. 50 out of- are we serious? Hey, are you serious? Are you a third of the way, huh? Guardian of time. Writing appeared on the dial. Give me a petal from your rose. In exchange, when you are in danger, I will save you. Um, what should we do? Do you believe this clock, Eve? I'm sorry, but I can't. I don't want to give him any petals. The shame. You know what? Let's see, sure. Deal is made. Red cloth step. Red clothed. Painting of a woman. Painting of a woman. A cookie coming on the ground. Ball with hole. Painting of a woman. There she goes. Wah! <coughs> oh man, I'm scared. You don't believe how much I'm shaking in my booties. <coughs> ah yes, this is one of the paintings in the gallery. Get a better look. Six nine five two or more five two. Six nine. Nice sixty-nine. That's that's no, that's nothing to scoff at. Noble boasting of gold. 
I've already forgotten the code. I'll probably get it. What's this door doing, huh? It's locked. Oh yes, we need a key. Hey, you weren't here before. A mannequin. <coughs> a mannequin head. What's in here? Can I go? Yes. Do nothing. We're not hurt. Please refrain from touching displays. If by any chance you damage any exhibits, you will be expected to pay with your life. Some of the letters are missing. Wonderful day. The gallery is like a spooky amusement park with lots of peculiar things. There's so much fun playing here. The day's over before you know it. Isn't it a fantastic place? Why won't you join me here? You'll never be lonely with all this company. I don't know why I picked this voice, but I just wanted to. This is creepy. Okay. Five. Right, 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 right. Five, two, six, nine. Is that right? Mm hmm. Seems to the door unlocked. Nice. 69 saves the day. There's something in front of the mirror. The golden fish. What's this? A model of a fish? Has a horn like protrusion. Ah, oh, the strange ball we picked up would fit perfectly on it. No, I wanted to look at the ball. I forgot. Go fish the ball with hole. I'll paint a golden lamp. Oh, it's bright. So this ball was a light bulb. A small yet incredibly bright angular fish lamp. Very creative. A large mirror. <clears throat> What's this written on the mirror? A fragment of the fish is by the yellow lady. Fragment of the fish. Could this be referring to the light bulb we attached to it? In that case, well, we already found it. Hey, good attention to detail, hey? Wow, no! Well, what is that? Why, you... Stop it. All right, Abe. Well, that was immature of me. Well, let's go. Mannequin head. Man, why aren't there achievements for getting all the endings, man? Like, encourage people to... Well, no. Well, yeah, 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 I mean... I don't know, I'm kind of torn. It's always tedious if I don't like the game, but this is E we're talking about. Say, what do you have there? A brightly shining lamp? Would you trade me for that elephant? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Then the elephant's yours. Got the golden elephant. Yep. Ah, oh, it's bright. How wonderful. Lights up the area. <clears throat> Here's a question. A large golden elephant model. It doesn't seem to be real gold. Oh, what a shame. If Gary can't weigh it down, how strong are we? No two ways about it. This isn't going to fit. Oh. Interesting. So... Um, okay, let's uh, walk around. Uh, golden elephant, what do we use this for? Not made of real gold, it could be important. Aye, here we are. That golden elephant, how big and beautiful. Would you trade it to me for this golden bird? Well then, shall we just put the elephant here? And taking this bird, the trade's complete. Take the golden bird. Thank you. Oh, what a big and beautiful golden elephant. It's not made of real gold, but sure. <clears throat> Sweet. An hour and ten minutes. We've almost hit this. Yeah. Put the golden bird in. Had Gary put in the golden bird. Because what's he good for? How freaking... Was that bird really so heavy? Well, at any rate, let's hurry and take a look inside. With how securely guarded this room was, there should be something. Perhaps an exit. Let's, uh, save... <clears throat> oh, what's this thing? I didn't want to sit for real. It's mom and dad. If you're tired, why not rest? You'll never suffer again. Something sitting on the frame. Got the gray key. Ah, uh, another key. No extra first this time. Abe, is something the matter? Huh? The people in this painting are your mom and dad? Huh. Not that you mentioned it, I can see the resemblance. Should I say now? Now that you mentioned it, I can see the resemblance. Why would such a painting be down here, I wonder? Huh? Where are they? Well, I can't say that I know that either. Don't worry, they must be somewhere. I thought she was a tough kid, but it's surely getting to her after all. 
Mother and father. Whoa! Uh -oh. What was that sound just now? I take a seat. I finish sitting. An ordinary gray key. Holding it makes you anxious somehow. <coughs> Excuse me. Man, how much flavor text did I miss already then? The door won't open. Are you kidding me? The door was wide open. The noise is that coming from outside? This could be bad. Be careful, Eve. Hey, it's that good old music. So, hey, crack. Oh, they're coming in through this way. Uh, push the boxes? No, no. Um, this is no time to be sitting around. Hello. Oh, I gotta leave through this hole in the wall. I remember. Why are there so many mannequins? What's going on? I think we better get out of here. Get away from here and quick. Eve, look. See the locked door over there? No, I would not be able to do it from this perspective. The great key we picked up should be able to open it. It has to. Let's make our way over. Won't you play more? Oh dear, that thing is a little freaky. Whoa, 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 okay, okay, it gets fast, it gets fast, it gets really fast. God, always in such inconvenient locations. We need a shortcut if we go through these, alright? Uh, alright then. Stop running, would you? You make the pages scatter. Ay, 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 hello. Oh, okay, 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 I'm sorry. As promised, I will stop time briefly. Oh, sweet. Well, that was worth my life. Use the gray key. Look at Mr. Mime getting a little sussy. Sussy on the wayside. I consume? Oh, I never, I don't talk to Gary enough. That should be far enough, I think. <laughs> we certainly showed them. My. <laughs> well then, let's keep moving. Abe? You look pale. Are you okay? And then she died. Abe, stay with me now. <laughs> Abe, 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 Abe. Credits, please roll. <clears throat> da, 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 I can't find my red rose. Eight, six, seven, five, three, oh, nine, nine. Lots of mannequins. No, it just triggers if I walk into them. Wherever you go, everyone's watching. Hey, Dad. Eep, where are you? You better run quick or I'll catch up. Oh, what do I do? I've searched everywhere, but I can't find her. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sorry. <laughs> hey, it's the, uh, face. I have to hurry to somewhere. Oh, man, someone shish on my paper. Sink spilled all over. You can't write in it anymore. Did you lose all the wreckage you made? Want to go home soon. <clears throat> be quiet in the gallery. You can't talk, or you'll be found. The rose melted the moment you touched it. You didn't take care of it, so it broke. You shouldn't lose it, you know. Oh, I can't check my inventory. Hey, Mom. Where did that girl get to? She has to go on her own, and then this... What a bother. If she doesn't hurry, won't be able to leave. Lots of doors. <coughs> you may stinky. <laughs> the woman the painting is smiling. Uh, smiling. 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 Whoops. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I can just spam it. Smiling. Smiling. Yes. Hey, mother and father. The exit is ahead. Hmm. Okay, there it is. Don't eat me. I don't want to eat in... Wait, wait, oh man. Wait, 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 wait. <clears throat> huh. Dilf Gary coming to the rescue. 
I hate everything. I can't believe I said that. I don't like it. Rise and shine, Eve. How do you feel? I had a nightmare. I see, you poor thing. Can't seem surprised. You've been put through such frightful things. Perhaps I shouldn't have woken you. Sorry, I didn't even notice. I mean, you shouldn't have woken me. I, I was having a nightmare. I was running for my life. Hey, would you dig in the pocket of that coat? <clears throat> yeah, I dig it. It's a piece of candy. You can have that. Feel free to eat it. Now, let's rest here a little while longer before we set out again. Oh, that's right. I placed your rose in that vase there. Gary's coat. Pick up. It's mine now. Gary's coat. It's tattered all over. Received from Gary the candy. It has a nice lemony smell. Hey, good old... Whoops. Whoops. Whoa. Untitled. Rules of the gallery. No loud conversation, no photography, no food or drink, no fountain pens, no leaving this place. Bleh. 54. 54! The woman here like to play loves me, loves me not. I see. Fun pictures. Still lots of large drawings. But were they fun? Oh my coat. How thoughtful of you, Eep. And over the coat. Hmm? My coat's all torn and ragged. Oh, no, no, that's on purpose. This is how it was designed. Though to be sure, it is getting a bit worn for many years of use. Say, Abe, how old are you? Nine? My, is that right? <laughs> I figured you would have been older. That's amazing, visiting a gallery at your age. If that were me, I'd cert I'm certain I'd be bored. Hmm? What am I reading? A book I found here, with lots of words. Even the title's a bit long. Suppose it may belong to Guertena? So interesting, I was lost in thought. But it may be a bit too difficult for you, Eve. Okay. Wait, is this random? Yeah, I was just so focused on getting out of here, I showed no consideration. No regard for you. Sorry about that. <sighs> I got up early today, so I'm feeling a bit sleepy now. I was so looking forward to going to the gallery after so long, and then this. Honestly, I think I've had enough of art galleries at this point. <laughs> this painting there, uh... It's titled, uh, Untitled. Is Untitled a title? Or is there no title making it untitled? Um, good question. I'll just take the middle road. <laughs> I've lost you, haven't I? It's fine, don't worry about it. Hmm, what is it? Why do you talk like a lady? <laughs> like a lady? What a question, but... Hmm, I can't quite remember. Just took to it, I suppose, but it's good to be gentle rather than rough, don't you agree? Oh man, I got a random. Come on, man, give it, let me let me ask again. I stare intently. <laughs> now this is the stuff I like. This is the stuff I remember from the original. Uh, not this in particular, but this. Oh man. Huh? Um. He, did I do something wrong? You're scaring me a little. <clears throat> This place it must be connected to that Gortane exhibit, don't you think? I wonder where all the other visitors of the gallery went. For all we know, there might be others who got lost in this place. If there are, I, I hope we can find each other. You know, I was debating this morning whether I should go out in something a little more fancy. But now I'm rather glad I chose to wear this. I do feel a bit out of place, though. Come on, man. Oh, shoot, I skipped. If there are, I... Wait, did I? Yes. Yeah, okay. Alright, uh, let's... Sorry for troubling you. Why, <laughs> there's no need, nothing to apologize for. You didn't even do anything wrong, Eve. I mean, no one could have predicted that things would end up like this. Come on, cheer up. It's a disservice to your adorable little fa Let me try that again. Come on, cheer up. It's a disservice to your adorable little face to look so dour. Alright, I think that's everything. What if I just, uh... Whoops! I know it's a bit late to point it out, but this is actually the first time I've seen a blue rose. I've never seen one, not even at the florist. I wonder if these actually exist in real life. Uh, I'm a little thirsty. Do you think I could drink from this face? I'm only joking. Now I think about it, you were walking around this place all by yourself until you found me. That's nothing to sneeze at. I mean it, that's brave. E we might need to keep walking for a while after this. I know I may not be the most reliable person for such a situation, but if you find yourself thinking I can't take it anymore, just tell me, okay? If need be, I can at least try to carry you on my shoulder. How old am I? Yes. Yep. Mm-hmm. 
Uh, come on. Give me some more. Eve, are you able to walk around? If you're tired, make sure you tell me right away, okay? Don't be shy about it. I'll completely understand. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, the title's untitled. Mm, I see. But then why give it such a name? Perhaps you didn't want to assign it meaning. Art is, is difficult like that. Whoops! I meant to... God dang it. There's no title. Yes, I was leaning towards that. Maybe you couldn't be bothered to come up with a title. After all, Gratana did seem to be very prolific. That is, he made lots of art. You know... Oh, yeah. Oh, sh yep. Okay, got that one. Uh, nothing. Ah, oh, jeez. I think that's everything. I hope that's everything, because, man, that was quite fun. I love flavor text, man. That's all you need. Oh, yeah, I need my rose. Abe, you ready to set out again? Not yet. There's no need to rush. Okay, nothing new, it seems. Abe, you ready to set out again? I'm ready. Okay, let's get going, then. Walk into me, Gary. I will... We will adventure. What if I go back? Look at this scary man looking at me with his scary eyes. Oh, man! Can I go back? E, let's not go over there anymore, okay? Hmm. I don't think we need to go back this way. Oh, man, I gotta talk to Gary a lot more. So far, the puzzles here seem to be solvable entirely within the same colored area. Perhaps if this place were all one color, we would have been we would have been running all over the place looking for hints. Milk puzzle. Eve, have you heard of milk puzzles? Um Well, only because of the first playthrough, but Well, they're puzzles where all the pieces are white like milk, hence the name. Since there's no picture on them, they're much harder than regular puzzles. Very smart people can finish them in no time at all, but to be honest, they're not exciting. Since they don't make it, they even make a picture in the end. It was much more worth it to do a puzzle of a picture you like. Oops. Oh man, I wanted to... Hang on, let's see. I want to know what he says. Ah, oh, jeez, I didn't talk to him all these times. I'm just going to mash this a bit. I should have saved before leaving. Uh, you know, I mean, I'm pretty sure the amount you talk to Gary is... depends on the ending. Let's do one, two, three, four, five. Alright, so that'll probably do. Whoops, I'm not ready. <clears throat> okay, let's head out. Whoops, I meant to not say no. R hashtag relatable when you mean to say yes to something, but you say no because you're too hasty. Well, actually, that does sound kind of realistic. Milk puzzle. My, so you have. Well, I'm not very good at them. I tried once a long time ago, but I couldn't get anywhere with all the pieces looking the same. I got so fed up, I ended up just forcing them all together. Except then the puzzle popped there, right? First apart, so it made a real mess. Fleeting thoughts on a moonlit night. <clears throat> What's this? Strangely patterned rock. Seems like I could move it, but it won't budge. What's, oh, it's a save point. Hmm, I can't push it from this side. Very different. I think we move that statue out of the way if we get around to the other side of it. Yes, me too. You don't have to sh flap your gums. What is this? Ah. Okay, very basic. Very... Ooh, I see. So I gotta do this, and then I gotta do this, and then I gotta do this, and then I gotta go around and uh, I don't... I gotta go around and then I gotta do a little bit of this, and then I gotta go around and do a bit of this, and then I gotta do this, and then I gotta go and I gotta do this, and then I gotta go and 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 go A large mare. Hey, it's us again. Nothing different? After that mannequin incident earlier, I don't watch. I don't much want to look into these mirrors. I found myself. 
Gary, close the book. You should wait until you're older to read this kind of thing. Haha, <laughs> you can't stop me. Okay, you did it again. Uh, we can move this... Really, no. <laughs> okay, that should do it. <clears throat> Alright. What's this? Separation. What an off-putting painting. The lights! What? <gasps> what? The lights? It's too dark to see! Eb, are you there? I'm not. What are you saying? Of course you're here. Still, this is a problem. Ah, oh, that's right. I forgot I had a lighter. A notice to all visitors. The gallery has a strict ban on fire starting implements. We request that you not bring in items like matches or lighters. Should the use of such items be reported to the staff? Huh? W what is this? I don't think this is good for my mental health. Stop. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I like that. Oh man, someone spilled their MS paint all over the floor. That store wasn't here before. Was it? Um, yeah, okay, let's go. Wait, I gotta talk to- Oh, hi. Ah? Uh? <clears throat> Whoa, are you okay? Uh, wait. Say, are you... Could you be one of the visitors to the gallery? Ah, as I thought. <sighs> My name's Gary, and this girl here is Ebe. We too were at the art gallery, but soon found ourselves lost in this odd place. So now we're working together to try and find a way out. I presume it's the same story for you? I... I was looking to see if there was anyone else, too. I wanted to get out, so I... <laughs> as I thought. Well then, would you like to come with us? Huh? It's dangerous to be alone here. There's lots of strange creatures around. So will you come with us? I think it would be best if we all stayed together. Yeah, I'll come. Then it's decided. Oh, uh, what's your name? Mary. Mary, then. Nice to meet you. Mm-hmm. Um, nice to meet you, too, Eb. Nice to meet you, too. Mm-hmm. All right, and with a new companion, let's proceed with our spirit tie. Yay! Hooray! All right! Say, Mary, you came from this way, didn't you? Was there, were there any other routes? Routes? I don't know. I walked a bunch, so I'm not sure. Ah, uh, well, for all we know, a path could appear where there was once a wall, like earlier. Though honestly, if it were a straight path, it wouldn't bode well. The Force of Quarrel. Mm. Which one is it, really? Well, I don't know. Why don't you tell me? Ah, oh, that's right. Seeing as Eve and I both have roses. Mary, do you perhaps have a rose as well? Yeah, I do. A yellow rose. Ah, so you do. You two keep those safe. Don't you dare lose it, and don't give it to anyone. And, wow, Eve's rose is red. My rose is yellow. I like yellow, but I also like pink. Oh, and blue. Then no, no, listen, would you? It's fun walking all together. Mary, you were alone until now. Were you attacked by any artwork? No, I was fine. Ah, so you were lucky. Some of the things here will definitely chase after you. Why did I read definitely? If you encounter one, run away immediately. Got it. I love running. <laughs> well, then you'll be fine. Oh, man. <clears throat> What's this? Flowers of Jealousy. Oh, yes. 59, baby. We're getting there. Oh, boy. Uh, uh, it's locked. Excuse me. Okay, I gotta stop. After every major event, I'll I'll try and speak. No good about me. Red eyes. Is that a Monty Python reference? <laughs> oh my god! For the love of this painting, this room. Why is it all so unsettling? Huh? Really? I, I think it's cute. What? What about this is cute? I just think it is. What about you, Eve? I want to pet it. Eep, do you really like this kind of thing? I can hardly stomach it. Gary, you're just a weirdo. You're the weirdos! Ah, never mind that. Let's investigate this place and get out of here already. I feel like I'm being watched in here. It makes me restless. Ruin of the Mind. 
If your mind suffers too much, you will soon start to hallucinate, and in the end, it will break apart. And more worrying yet is that you will not even be aware of that fact. Oh no! Something gleams amid the shards. Obtain the violet key. A rabbit ornament. I'll make a, uh... <clears throat> I'll make a separate save right here. Just in case I want to come back and get a different ending on my own time. There's a sound coming from the painting. It's Plantera! What? Huh? That sounds getting closer. Yes, it is. Uh, something came up from the floor! This seems bad. Get away from the painting! Eve, watch out! Are you two all right? Oh, that scared me. What about you, Eve? Are you hurt? I'm okay. Oh, thank goodness. With these things in the way, I can't get over there. Breaking them is probably impossible. They're absolutely huge. What to do? Hey, Eve, you got a key in that room, right? Maybe that key opens that door there. We might find something inside that can break these. So, hey, can we go look? Hmm. Well, I wonder if you'll be okay by yourselves. We'll be fine, right, Eep? Uh, I think so. See, Eep thinks we'll be fine. My, is that so? Well, I suppose I'll let you look. Fine. But if you don't find anything, make sure you come straight back, understand? Then we'll reconsider our options. Yeah, got it. Okay, let's go. Eep, let's hurry up and go. Use the violet key. More boxes? I love this game! A large statue. I bet we could break those spikes if we whacked them with this. Way too heavy to move, though. There's no one around, but you can feel the presence. I'd like to take the stool, but it's so heavy I can't lift it. Why is that? A sketch of some strange thing. So the yellow drawing... Drawing paper? Drawing... drawing yellowed drawing paper. That's packed with various art supplies. Hmm. Is there anything useful in here? Ah! There's a palette knife deep in the box. Maybe this can start those spiky things. Let's try it. <laughs> As if that would work. You're not good with jokes, are you, Eve? But I think I'll hold on to this. You know, just in case. Nothing new. Filled with worn paintbrushes. Various used paints. Hmm. I don't really see anything useful. So we just go back to Gary for now? Wow! Huh? <laughs> That scared me. Oh man, he moved. I don't like the dark. It's scary not being able to see. Huh? The door. Why is that statue there? Wasn't it against the wall just now? Let's move it, Eep. What if we go this way? Shall we go back to Gary? No. Gary's a loser. Ready? Heave! Ow! Oh god, I won't even budge. What do we do, Eep? We can't get out. I wonder if Gary's waiting for us. I guess we'll just have to look over this way, Ape. <clears throat> yep. Oh, there's a secret. What's this? I want you to have fun, Ape. Come to a fun world without any grown-ups. Fallen Star. Ape, do you know the circus? It's a place where they throw around lots of balls and go inside of lions and mouths and stuff. <coughs> Clown. <laughs> its nose is sticking out. Look. Oh, it came off. Phew, stuck it back on. A painting that looks like a swing. What was this? We'll be together. You, me, and our friends. Painting's got eyes on it. What's it looking at? I don't know. What's you looking at? There's a hole in the floor. I wonder what Gary's doing. We kind of left him behind. Can I talk to myself as Gary? Sure, taking their time. I wonder if something happened. Eve! Mary! Say something if you can hear me! No use. Oh, I knew I shouldn't let him go alone. What oh, now? 
suppose I'll investigate that room again. Which is, I hate to go back in there. Giant plants blocked away. Hey, what's... I got an inventory? Wristwatch, it stopped ticking since coming to the gallery. Lighter, after years of use, is running low on oil. Rare blue rose, as it wilts, so do you. Oh, look at that, edgelord. Um... I guess save over, huh? Yep, different. Very, very, very different. It's disturbing doll. Red eyes. No matter how I look at this, is not cute. When it suffers too much, you will soon start to hallucinate, and the end break apart. More worrying, yet you're not aware of that fact. Nothing a note here. Oh, this bookshelf. Yeah, it's got skid marks. Why, it moves! Why didn't I notice that earlier? Oh, well, I can go out this way. The floor has a strangely shaped indent in it. Alright, let's... Um, yeah, okay, I need to pull a lever. The number four. What if I pull the wrong one? Oh. I had enough of this place. What do you do? He just tickled me? I'm really getting sick of this. You must be kidding me! It switches off the lights? Oh, thank goodness. I thought it wouldn't come back. <coughs> what is this? Gary farted. Cannon confirmed. <coughs> hey guys, you know the game Eve? <laughs> Gary farted. That's my head cannon. There is no exit. There is no reason. Same plans as before. Better do something about these, or I really won't be able to go anywhere. Hey, Bubba. Hey, look, there's a bridge now. Is it okay to cross? Stare back intently. Da 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 da. What are you doing, Eve? Come on, let's cross. Is it okay to cross? Yeah. Guess so. Yeah. Oh, wait. Hey, so what's that bright blue thing? Sounds like it's made of plastic. <laughs> and then, good old Gary boy. Oh, very nice. Very satisfying. Kind of. Not really, but... Nothing new. Hello. It's a shipping doll. Hello there, Gary. I don't like being alone, so take me with you. Sorry, the game won't let me. Hey, why aren't you taking me? Because the game won't let me. Why are you ignoring me? Do you hate me? No, the game won't let me. Hey, play with me. I know lots of fun things we can do. Like what? I bet you can't tell me. You know why? Because the game won't let you. Look at my arms. I got loads of friends too. I'll introduce you. That'd be nice, but the game won't let me. Be here forever. No, I can't. The game won't let me. Well, actually it would, but I won't let me. <laughs> How long are you going to follow me? Enough of this, I'm busy here, and I'm not gonna be your buddy! Move it out of the way. Times like this, it's best to ignore it. There's no keyhole, the door must open some other way. Take me! Depths. <clears throat> no keyhole. Must open some other way. I might be wrapping this stream up in about half an hour. The doorknob is strangely cold. We can do part two, I'm sure. Although I'm not really familiar with how much is left. 
Two of one flesh, a working combination. I'm afraid I only see one, though. Assist the juggler. Juggling. Uh-oh, I'm gonna lose health. A voice comes from the painting. What year was I born? 1987. Wrong. Ow! What is this painting? What is this? Oh, God. Fishing hook. There's no hook. Heart in custody. A heart, you say. Marvelous night. Is that cheese? No. What is this giant thing? Oh, hello again. I'll follow you forever. My home is just nearby. What's this now? Some kind of ball? Found a mysterious ball, yellow. Ah, uh, it vanished. Depths, yeah. Uh, oh yes, bros do nothing. Those are four H points. <laughs> oh my god, the hiccups. What was, what was that? Zigzagger? Was that the name of the room? Collect the seven colored balls of paint, and then the path shall surely open. Balls of paint? Could it mean that the ball that vanished earlier? Chili, why does all the artwork here have to be such in such troublesome spots? You see, he's got a spooky face. Okay, oh, I must open some other way. Ugh, what kind of room is this? They gotta watch out for that strange gas coming from the floor. Oh dear, I'm going to die. Well. I won't give up. I won't give up. You can't make me. I, Dr. Robotnik. <clears throat> a true ninja never gives up. Also, a good Let's Player shouldn't make the same joke at the same time in a single episode. What am I doing? Oh, yes, need more HP. <laughs> Need more health, penis. More health in my penis. Mysterious ball, violet. Alright, back I go. Um, let's get some water. Alright, it's got the purple. I... Let's go back to Eeb. Yeah, you guys can move now. Wow. What's this place? What's this place? What are those things? Eyes? Different... Hey, Abe, can I ask you something? Is Gary your dad? Uh, he's a stranger. Oh, really? Hmm. So you met here? Huh. Is your mom nice, Abe? Yes. Oh, lucky you. You want to see your parents again soon, right? I want to get out soon, too. Hey, so, Abe. If only two of us could get out of here, what would you do then? Why are you asking that? Huh? I don't know, just cause. You know, just wondering about what you might do if that happens. I was curious, that's all. Whatever, let's get going. That was just a what if, okay? The unknown of unknown and stars. The night sky is pretty. I can hardly believe there's so many white specks up there. Then when we get out, let's count how many there are together. Heavenly Thread. What if it's just God's really long poop drooping from the heavens above? Worry. Tattletale. Skin and bones? Fisherman. There's nobody there, though. Lots of paintings. Let's take a look. Two of one flesh, a working combination. The paintings connect together. How fun. Um, oh, what's this? Another sacrifice? Guardian of the door. Writing appeared in the mirror. Answer with the name of the painting! If you are correct, I will open the door! What will it be? What if I get it wrong? It's just names of paintings, right? Sounds fun, let's do it! Uh, sure, take the challenge. Well then, which is the title of this painting? Uh, Heavenly Thread. Correct. Woohoo! Way to go, Eep! Now for the next painting. 
Huh? There's more? Uh... Depths. Correct. Yay! Eve wins! As promised, I will open the door! Guardian of the door. Sussy baka. I dislike this man. Dried up something light forms. Square rock. This was this this one's the only regular rock. Weird. There's stuff here too. There's <laughs> so much to do. A creature you've seen in a textbook. I know this one. I saw it in a book. It said it went extinct a long time ago. So like, what's extinct anyway? A snail. It's like a big lollipop. I, in a way, I, I guess. A hermit crab. The sharp edge looked like it had hurt. There's a painting high on the wall. Mm, I can't reach it. Why would we need to? Whoa! That lady's packing. Lady without her umbrella. Okay, um... I need to know what year that dude was born. What's this place? There's no color. Guys, is that a drawn life person? Guys, guys, this place is weird. How do we how do we color it in? There's a rainbow on the canvas. Flowing palette and brush. It's like there's someone here. Can't see the bottom. Okay, so um uh Wait, what did I... Did I miss something here? Yeah, okay. I need an umbrella for her. These are the spikies from before. So they're here too. Thought there was like a hole in her head or something. What does the door... Did I go... I did not go in here. What the heck is wrong with me? A girl's demise. Once upon a time, there was a little girl. That girl went to an art gallery with her parents. But all of a sudden, the girl realized that she was lost. She searched through the dim gallery, but found neither her parents nor the exit. Scared, helpless, lonely, hungry, and thirsty, she fell and hurt herself, and at her body's limit, the last page is an illustration of a collapsed girl. I can't see the picture. I love pictures. Collect the works of Quartana, part one. It contains painting by Quartana, organized by letter. Uh, J for juggler. Juggling, 6223. What? Ye what? A work based on a juggler Guaitena saw at the circus with his grandchild. As, an is as it is extremely rare for Guaitena to use real people as models, this piece is highly valuable. 1662. G. The fish. Through gra though grayscale, this curious piece makes clever use of shading and angles to give the impression of color. The detail put into, the even to even the sc into even the scales... Conveys a wide variety of emotions in people. The Lady in Red. The, it was said that Gortana based this on a lover he had at the time, but he has denied this claim. In truth, Gortana based it around the woman who attempted to marry him for his inheritance. Uh, just to make sure. 6223. Hey guys, it's a big piece of gum, oh boy. It's a large roll of paper. Unroll it and... It's a painting, but what's it a painting of? What should we do with it? Should we take it? Uh, sure, why not? Odd painting. It wasn't in a frame. What painting is it even? 6223, right? 6... 2... Two, three. C O R E C T. Thanks for giving me your balls. Found a mysterious ball. Blue. Juggling. Um. Oh, you're been moved. Hey, you want a treasure hunt? I want to play too. Look at that. I got three dots. Let's save, I guess. Uh, it's been a little while. And, uh... What's, no, I got that painting. What can I... What can I use this painting for? Locked. Nothing here, it seems. This painting...
pinning is so big, it's hard to carry around. Um, can I take it this way? I'm just gonna take a walk back real quick, see what's going on. Probably doing this wrong, I just... Yeah, I don't need, no need to drop this down, I guess. Um, large painting, huh? Hmm. Maybe there's more I can do with Gary, huh? Oops, okay, I already did read that. Maybe it's for later. I guess let's try and push a little further with Gary, huh? So... Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, we need water or something. How long has it been since I've, uh, yeah. Um... That's locked. Um, this is locked as well, I believe, right? Yeah, what do I do, huh? Is there a door here someplace on the back, maybe? Uh, I want to play two. Marvelous Knights. So, am I stupid? Am I missing... What's down here? There's similarity here, right? Yes. Hey, does that weird painting look... We doesn't that weird painting we picked up look kind of like these snake ones? Maybe this is a failed attempt. Try... Aye, hey! Yes, uh... Replace these snake paintings. Which one do you want to swap out? Let's do the belly. Now it looks like it swallowed something. Let's put this extra one to the sides. Okay, must have gotten it right. I hear snakes can swallow food bigger than themselves whole. Let's leave it like this. Whoops, I meant to... Whoops, I meant to, uh... Just tell me if you want to swap those snake paintings again. I'll handle it for you. Yeah, baby. Huh, <sighs> this painting change. Is there something in that snake's belly? Oh no, he threw up his heart. A pulsing object could obtain the glass heart. Surely it's artificial, right? A heart model made of glass. It feels oddly warm. Yeek. Heart in custody. Ah, oh, there's a thing I picked up. Here you go. Health up. Taking off books is forbidden. Hello, mister. An umbrella. Why is an umbrella here? Oh, well, I guess I'll take it. Look at him, chabbering. Could serve as a weapon in a pinch. Obtain the red umbrella. Via a trading of existences, the fantastical can be made a reality. I'm not sure that I understand. There's no fear greater than the unknown. Like that one dude said. Terror. Being alone is frightening. A pair of two can bring relief. A group of three. The rest have been torn off. There's a crowd. I hope even Mary are okay. Well, at least they have each other. The essentials of color. It describes the uses of color. This is pretty difficult stuff. Oh? Nice. Now we can have that paintball match when everybody's home and happy. Enlightenment. So... This place just get in the way at every turn. As I recall, they retracted earlier when I fed that moon into the floor. Can I move this at all? No. Okay, so there must be something. And what did this... Oh, wait! Hey, the fisherman's here. Fishing hook. What's up with this? It's coming out of the painting. Could it be, well, an actual hook? Let's touch it, because I, 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 I'm, it's, it's, hey guys, it's a me, um, I forgot his name. The, the, uh, the, the protagonist of Silent Hill 2. Whatever, man, just touch it. 
What happen if I touch it? You'll die! Ouch! Ow, I got my finger. Could it be, well, an actual hook? Yep. No, wait, I forgot to read the umbrella. I wonder if I hang this umbrella on it. Huh? It went right into the painting. It's just one inexplicable thing after another here, isn't it? All right, save. And back to the gag, the good cast. Fisherman. Hey, Abe, look, he caught something. Is for me. An umbrella placed by the fisherman. Got the red umbrella. Oh, uh, E. Umbrellas are so neat. You can fly holding these, right? That's right. So cool. I want to try flying too. But you shouldn't do it inside, huh? Then I'll definitely fly when we get outside. You think this umbrella can destroy the spikes? Maybe we whack him a bunch with it. That'll break it? Yeah, I guess. Maybe not then. Let's see. Whoops. Uh, Q? No, X. A bright red umbrella fished up by the fisherman. Let's save and uh, got the umbrella for the raging woman over here. Eep, we have an umbrella? Found the umbrella on the front of the painting. Huh? Huh? It started raining in the room. That's so weird. But hey, this guy's out. It's moving. Where do you think it's going? It's on. It, it's on top of me. Oh, it's a stool. Looks like it will serve as a stepping stool. Thanks. Rotation. Huh? This painting rotates. Let's try turning it. Let's see what that did downstairs, huh? It is different, is it not? No, it's not. It doesn't seem to be. Hmm. Rotation, huh? Oh, I need to make it the same as the thing downstairs. Okay, so there we go. That should probably do it, right? Red and green. Maybe, uh... Yeah, that's right, is it not? You and the turtle stare at each other for a bit. Wow, where's this water coming from? I'm at a loss. It's matched, is it not? It, it, it's... Hmm, and more of these. Hmm. Yeah, no clue. What have I got? Nothing good. Nothing. So I gave the umbrella, it made the place rain, I have access to this painting. Let's try it like that. Oh, okay, so it stops gas flow. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, so that's probably right, isn't it? To make uh, the green sta start? Yes. Seems this painting actually rotates. Sweet. Me lucky charms. That was awfully meaty for a, 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 a stone vine sound effect. There we go. Now the thorns in the study should have withdrawn as well. Or so you think. Oh, nice. It gets... It gets uh, the color fades as you die. Isn't that great? Let's save. Hi, 
How you doing, Bubba? Good? Hate to hear it. Mysterious ball, pink. Strained ear. I'd like to watch the Guartana. Or as a little painting. I wonder if there's anything useful. Serpentine spirit. Beginning with this piece, Guartana shifted to a greater focus on abstract art. But at the time, cubism was more in vogue, leaving Guartana's various abstract works largely ignored. H page, The Hanged Man. Guartana apparently painted this as a page filler while doing binding for a work, ma work for a magazine. With illustrations each issue, it became renowned. Renowned, whatever. It was later sold for a limited time as a tarot card. Presently, it is next to a Presently, it is next to impossible for one to come upon this tarot card. What if there's anything useful? Mary, the last work of Gortana's life. While the girl appears almost lifelike, she is, of course, not based on a real person either. There's a familiar painting on the page next to the description. Whoa, no, I can't believe it. Why? It can't be. That's... Mary? Yes. She doesn't exist? What does that mean? But then, who... Or what is with Eep? I heard it. I heard it. Mary's secret. Oh, no. Yeah, it's uh, getting late, fellas. Let's do just push a tiny bit further, then we're gonna give this up. Treasure hunting is fun. I found treasure too. Oh, stomach looks a bit bloated. Check the doll. I suppose I'll take a closer look. That's what you mean by closer look. Okay, just rip them the frick open. Oh. I'm not going in there yet. Unless there's nothing left to do, I guess. Uh, is that... Oh, I'm missing one color? Alright, this is the showdown, it seems, hey? Now, this is where I should make the uh, separate save, I believe. Doors unlocked. Go in. Mala paint, white. That's seven of them. Huh? No way. It won't open. Why? Let's have another treasure hunt. Who, who, who has the key? What's that? Okay, I gotta get the frick out of here, man. What? What now? This doesn't look good. I need to find the key and get out. Nothing inside. Ugh. Not here. Ugh. There's nothing inside. There has to be a key somewhere, right? Pebbles, what even is this? Oh, he's already ripped. I feel a piece of broken. Why this of all things? Nothing inside. Please show up already. Is this Ash? Where's the key? I can't find it anywhere! You cut your finger on something. Well? I'll just save over that separate save and let's load because I fricked up. Doors unlocked. <sighs> I got the paint. Let's get the flip out of here. Get the heck out of Dodge. Yep. Can I move? Can I move? Can I move? What? What, what now? This look good. I need to find the key and get out. Nothing inside. Uh. Oh. What even is this? Not here. Oh, 
Yes, the key! Is it seriously randomly generated every time? If so, that's some real bogus. Hey, okay, get the ball. This is because I kind of want to see what the thing says. What? What now? Doesn't look good. Welcome to our home. Stop confusing me like that. Come on, get out, get out, get out! Oh my god, are you serious? One tile away! Why? Uh... Just mashing the key. Mashing the key. You can hear me. You can hear my frustration. Oh, maybe if I wouldn't have read that stuff. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give come on, come on. Oh my god. Dude, come on, man. Why is this so stupid, dude? It's just, it has just, I just, just come on. We're not stopping until we do this. But we are stopping straight after we do this. Assuming that we do this. Which we will. I think. Whoops! That's what I get for mashing. <laughs> okay, here's the plan. Go... What? what no. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. I'm wasting time. I'm wasting time. Dude, 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 dude. Well, I'm dead. Is it randomly generated? Or do I need to open a certain amount before getting out? I, I, I don't know. I don't get it. I don't understand. Yes, the door won't open. I understand. Let's take the this side here. I'm just spamming, just spamming, just spamming. Bro, 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 bro. Okay, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. No! No! Dude, 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 I was right there! I was right there! Oh. Come on. 
Come on, why is it so hard, dude? It shouldn't be, right? Okay, let's do the same, 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 same thing. Okay, just mashing space, mashings. Dude, dude, let me go! Go, 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 go! Ah, don't get caught on the dialogue boxes! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Okay, okay, okay! <laughs> okay! <laughs> I have had enough of that room! Why did I have to go through that? Da 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 This is no time to be whining. You might be in a terrifying situation of her own. We gotta regroup soon. Alright, 70 out of 150. Uh, I doubt if 50. I don't know what that reference is, but it's a reference to something. Pause of paint, yes. The seven colors are simple. Thus settles the matter. Stairs. I've come this far, but... I've come this far, but I'm wondering if I should keep going. But I'm not sure what good going back is gonna do. What to do? Perhaps I'll explore this floor a bit more. And I think that's gonna do it for the stream. So yeah, thanks for sticking by if you did, and I'm going to close with another one of my dang old crazy, crazy face dreams. Alright, so, back to the dreams, baby. I have it written down, the title, I'm going to find it. The time I sued Fanta because I ran a red light. <laughs> okay. I have the recording on my phone. I would play it. I would I would have uploaded it to the computer to play it for you. But I think I dropped a bunch of names. I want to keep it... I don't want to have to share names if I don't have to. So basically, what happened is I got a brand spanking new red car, right? And uh, what I did is I went to the gas station. Because there's a... A gas station, they've got really, really good chicken sandwiches there. Like, oh god, it's, it's the greatest. People, like, flock there for that food. In real life, I'm saying. Like, it's a really good place to eat. But, uh, I go there to pick up some food. I get a soda, I get a sandwich, I take it, and I start driving home in my new, brand, great-looking red car. Now, on the way home, I see there's a roundabout. Just a muddy roundabout. Just a big old donut sitting in the grass. All muddy and everything, and I'm thinking, you know what? I'm gonna take my new car there. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a couple cookies round, and then when I'm done, I'm gonna go home. So, <sighs> hang on, excuse me. I take my car, and not even a halfway turn through that roundabout, I go, I completely lose control. I go flying out of my car. My car takes off to the freaking heavens. It goes flying through the sky. I get thrown, I'm tumbling all over the place. I finally stop, and the thing just, it just disappears. It's gone. And I'm thinking, oh god, Jesus, what the frick did I just do? How, oh my god, where's that car going? What's gonna happen? So I get up, I run to the gas station, I ask, hey guys, did you uh, hear any crash at all by chance? Did you see a, uh, uh, a cool new uh, red car go flying by? And they're like, no, I got no idea, sorry. And I'm thinking, well, I guess shit, it's out of my hands. I can't, what can I do, huh? So I walk home. It takes like an hour to get home. Or at least it should, anyway. I get home, and there's this woman in the garage. Ah, oh, I gotta remember this part. Hang on, I'm gonna try and pl get the recording to play a little bit. To uh, freshen my memory, whatever it may be. But there's this woman sitting there, and uh, yeah, she's just. Let's see. Okay, that's a different dream. 
That's another dream I got to share. Well, not really. It's not exactly a very good dream, not eventful. It's like just pish posh compared to what I got coming up. But the woman in my garage, I think she was yelling at somebody. Her child, maybe? I can't quite remember. I'm going to try and find the... the uh... Oh, is this it? Okay, basically, I had a pretty weird dream last night. So basically, um, I had a red car. Nice all right, car. all right, so this is it. I'm going to mute the mic. Give me a second. Okay, here it is. Alright. Nobody saw anything, so I go home. By the time I get there, it's nighttime. And then there's this older woman and this little girl in my garage, and she's breaking a drumstick in half. The little girl is breaking a. Okay, I think I got it. A drumstick in half. And the woman's like, what are you doing that for? So you can stab me? And then the little girl stabs her and she starts screaming. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> I don't remember that. She starts screaming, I think. You know, this is handy. This makes a good weapon. Yeah, so that's what I was thinking. After witnessing someone get stabbed... I look at the drumstick and I'm thinking, you know, this would make a great weapon. Like, you know, usually you hold it normally and it's like, yeah, what are you going to do? Are you going to tap me on the nose or something? But then I, then I, you pull out your trump card and you flip it over and you hit them with the heavy end. And I thought this was a great idea, like a pro gamer move. You cannot go wrong with this method of assault. So after that, I leave the through by the back door of the garage. And I run, because that old woman is still bleeding and screaming and trying to find me. I, she was chasing me for some reason. So I stop, I go and hide. And she's just circling the house, looking around, trying to find me. And she she just circles around, and she out of sight, out of mind. And as I'm sitting there hiding, I look over, and there's a newspaper sitting next to me. I pick it up. I read it, and the top headline says that there was a car that went flying through the air and crashed into a local high school. A red car. And I believe... I might get the numbers wrong. I could just, I'll just pull up the original dream. I just I'll, It was complete havoc. So I pick up the dream missing me. So I run out and be missing. Okay, here. In circles, for some reason. I don't know if she was looking for me or not. I think she was. But... After that, I reach in my pocket, and there's a newspaper article talking about my car, and apparently my car crashed into a school and killed 12 people, injured 50, and sent 30 missing. <laughs> yeah, so it's just a complete tragedy, dude. I'm thinking, God dang, I was responsible for that, huh? Whew, that's not good. So, I just, you know, forget it, man. I go to bed. I wake up. Sorry, sorry, I was just thinking of another dream that was kind of similar to that. I, I told you guys already in the Drawn to Life one. The one with the uh, weasel people. But, oh, dang it, where was I? Yeah, so I go to sleep, I wake up the next morning, and I try to drive to school, to college. And on the way there, there's a stoplight that turns red. And in a lot of my dreams, for some reason, it's just always... Brakes never work in my dreams. It's just, you hit the brakes, it's going to take seven seconds longer than it should to stop you. Assuming you even stop at all. So, you know, there I am. I'm trying to stop for this light. I hit the brakes. I'm in the turning lane, by the way, so I just keep skidding forward and keep going straight. And I'm, I'm just flooring the brake. I'm like, dude, why is this not stopping? So I just go by, I end up running the light. And I'm thinking, you know what? This is bad. People are looking at me like I'm freaking crazy. But, you know, it's okay. Like, it, it was out of my hands, out of my power. I do nothing. I, there's literally nothing I could have done to not have run that red light aside from crashing someplace else. And I'm saying, I mean, 
at least, you know, if a cop pulls me over, I'd be able to explain to him, it's, everything's okay, it's okay. And then all of a sudden, the stoplight itself starts flashing red and blue, and I hear a siren in the distance, I'm like, god damn it, dude, are you serious? A cop comes up, stops, parks, he asks me, so, son, what were you doing just now? You know, I just realized, I, I can't play this whole recording, actually. I could play this entire recording. I got this dream mixed up with the Weasel People one. Hang on. Normal lane, and then the light turns red. Yep. So I start hitting the brakes, but I just keep going, and I don't stop. I keep sliding. I'm like, okay, you know what? It's forgivable. I can't stop. I'm just going to have to run this one, because if I start doing this, I'm going to start spinning out, and I'm going to crash into a whole bunch of people. So I just go straight through the light, and I'm like, okay, I mean, it's it's fine. Nobody really saw much. And then I have a good reason for doing it. And then all of a sudden, the, like, the lights start flashing blue and red, and then a cop comes out of nowhere, and he pulls me over. I'm like, okay, great. I, I can just, god dang it. I can explain it to him, I hope. So he goes by, pulls me over, and... I don't remember this part of the dream very well, but he asked me a whole bunch of questions that had nothing to do with my car, and I never got to explain to him why I ran the red light. So, next thing I know, oh, by the way, we were, I, I kept driving until I went into PL Pier from Team Fortress. Oh, yeah. And I pulled over on the side on a sidewalk. <laughs> but, um, then all of a sudden we're at my house and then I get to explain to him that my tires are bad. You know, I can't, I wasn't able to stop. I just kept sliding and he takes a look at my tires and I'm like, Oh man, that looks pretty bad. And then something happens. And the next thing I know, I'm suing Fanta for, <laughs> we got Fanta over to, okay. Wait, I missed a tiny detail is that the dude asked me, okay, so I think I might know a way out of this. The policeman, he says, do you know the guy who invented cobblestone? And I, and my mom's like, oh man, I remember I went to college for this. Let me, let me try and <clears throat> look through my uh, papers I had to write. And she does that, and I'm sitting there like, oh dude, this is a no-brainer. I pull out my, those uh, uh, little uh, Minecraft survival guides, you know, for those little books they made. I pull it out, and I can't find anything. And then the cop says, you know what, it's fine. You know, next time... Next, next best thing, we can just sue the Fanta Corporation. Because you had a bottle of Fanta in your car when it slid. Therefore, Fanta caused your accident. <laughs> just a bunch of BS logic. I'm going to play the rest of the recording as it is. No, no, no. We, he's oh. like, well, it depends, son. We can, you, you can get off the hook for this. It's just... Do you know the guy who invented cobblestone? Okay, okay. I, I said, oh, I know. He's like from Minecraft or whatever. <laughs> and I go to grab my Minecraft information book to try and figure it out because for some reason in that dream, I remember reading about it before. My mom took a history class on it and she was <laughs> trying to figure it out. And the cop just, I don't know. He's, he thinks he remembers, but he doesn't. And we can't figure it out. So he's like, all right, next big thing. We're going to sue the Fanta Corporation because they made you run a red light. Because I don't, I don't know. We just decided to sue the Fanta Corporation. We we sued Fanta because I ran a red light. <laughs> we held them at fault for me uh, sliding through. And like, okay, and we didn't even take it to court. We just stayed in the garage and. He's like, okay, we're going to go out to the same stoplight, we're going to dump a bunch of Fanta on the ground, and we're going to drive your car through it and see if you slide. If you slide, then you win the lawsuit. If you don't, then you lose the lawsuit. And then we all start handing out freaking drinks, and we have a party at my house for suing Fanta. And, th and the thing is, the people behind, the CEO of the Fanta was there at my house enjoying the party as well. And my dad's like, you know, if we do this, we could become millionaires overnight. And I'm like, okay, I don't know. I mean, is this because I drove, when I had my red car, I had Fanta. I went there and I bought Fanta. So is that why we're suing them? Because I bought Fanta and then I crashed into a school? 
And that was it. I, I don't remember anything else, but that was the entire dream. We sued Fanta because I ran a red light, and we I think we won. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> I don't know, man. That's it. Yeah, so that's that dream. And, uh, <laughs> yeah. I'm running out of big dreams to share. So, you know, I'm... What? Yeah, um, I did have like a small flash flood of dreams recently. Uh, just short ones. Some of them were... One of them was a good one. It was a nice and long one. Very intense. It was a pretty long, a lengthy text message. I shared it with my friend. And the other two were just really weird. They're kind of short. I'll probably share two short ones. You know, next stream, I'll share two short ones and the other long one at the end. So that's another thing to stick by and look forward to. So yeah, that's going to do it. Thanks for sticking by if you did, and I appreciate your company. We'll be picking this up again another time, and until then, I will see you. So yeah, thanks. Goodbye.